congratulations on a franchise best four and one start. Uh, it must feel well, despite taking your last game as a loss. It's been a very positive beginning in Detroit for you and the crews. Yeah, for sure. Appreciate it. And, uh, you know, these guys, they've worked hard. And so start so far has been in our favor, but uh, we got a lot we can grow from. So really excited about it. You talk about the spirits of this group and what an advantage it is to have a collective spirit that's together. Talk about why that's so important and how this team encompasses that. Yeah, uh, in any level you're at, um, you really want a bunch of guys that are going to compete and compete every night and compete together. And that's what this group does. They really root for each other. They like to jo uh, join in in each other's success and each other's story. And that's the cool thing about being around these guys. And so if you got a connected group, you always give yourself a chance. And so far, we've done that. You've done it with a deep group and scoring five guys, 16 or more points. And it seems like you've got the rebounding figured out as well with the number two rebounder in the league in Porter. That's a good way to start with a little bit of diversity in the scoring and somebody who can protect the rim a little bit. Without question. You know, John Tay has done a tremendous job for our basketball team on both ends of the floor. And so uh, I preach force. You know, we want to play with force, and uh, he's done that so far. And we've taken on his lead there in the glass and in the paint so far. Xavier Simpson, 31 points his last time out. He's a guy that's in the top 10 in assists. He's taking care of the basketball. The big reason why you guys are first in the league in assist to turnover ratio. Yeah, he's uh, something we talked about this summer, and he brought to me that he, he wanted to be a high, high level assist guy in the league and lead the league in assists and stuff like that. So uh, we, we move him around, put him in a lot of pick and roll situations, try to get him uh, to where he can find his reads and where he's comfortable and a lot of that. I'm giving him the freedom to go. And so there's a trust there that we built over the last couple of weeks. And uh, it's been a pretty cool deal having him as the head of the snake. They'll try to get it going tonight against a Cleveland team that will have one of their two way guys, Amani Bates, a local sure. guy. Um, but this is an offense that lights to light it up from downtown. How do you defend the three against the charge? Got to be mindful of our matchups. But the main thing is we got to contain the basketball. You know, if we if we have to help and over help in the paint, that's when guys get kickouts, especially with Sharif Cooper out there. Who, he really finds the corners well and all that stuff. So uh, we've got to keep guys in front of us so that we can stay home on matchups. And then we got to make sure we contest without fouling and limit them to one shot. If they get on the glass and get to spray out, uh, that's where those easy looks come. What was your best thing you ate for a Thanksgiving meal? And were you able to have a real Thanksgiving meal in your first Thanksgiving in Detroit? I did. I did have a, a, a proper Thanksgiving uh, popcorn. <laughs> it would definitely, <laughs> definitely be my favorite part of the meal. That's uh, it's a guilty pleasure of mine. Popcorn is, is everything to me. So Love it. Get your popcorn out. It's the cruise and the charge. Thanks again for joining yeah, us. Thanks. All the best tonight. Thanks a lot. Man. I really appreciate it. All right.